Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kelly. Hi, if you're new, today I'm so excited to sit down and share with you guys some of my favorite spring wardrobe essentials for the preppy gal. You guys might know I love sharing the preppy style. I love sharing fashion videos, and I really think everything that I wear is based on a capsule wardrobe. So I'm going to be breaking down and sharing with you guys my favorite pieces to build the perfect spring wardrobe. I think this video will be helpful in case you guys are new to the preppy style or in case you need a little bit of a refresh for your current wardrobe. I hope you enjoy this video. Video, definitely hit that subscribe button down below and give this video a big thumbs up if you guys found it helpful and in the comments down below I would love to hear from you guys I do read and respond back to every single comment so if you have any spring wardrobe must-haves let me know in the comments down below I love chit-chatting with you guys and we are just gonna get started I just pulled out all of the clothes that I'm gonna be talking about today from my closet I finally did my spring wardrobe switch I love storing my winter and fall clothes together I used to when I lived at my parents house kept them under my bed I had like a lifted twin bed it was perfect but now I keep it at my parents house in my old bedroom closet and then I will put my summer and spring Spring clothes together so currently I have my summer and spring clothes in my closet here at my apartment and I'm so grateful to say that but I love changing it and categorizing that way that might be a helpful tip for you in case you're in a similar situation now I will say it might be a little different since I am a fashion influencer and I love sharing my outfits on the daily we are gonna get started with some of my favorite spring wardrobe pieces the first thing is a simple short sleeve top this one is from Vineyard Vines it's just a solid blue short sleeve t-shirt Shirt. I love it. This is a great basic to have in your wardrobe. It doesn't have to be blue, but any solid color. This will go with so many pieces, and I have a whole video on my channel. I will insert a card in case you guys want to check it out. It is styling 10 pieces into 40 different outfits, and a lot of these pieces, and when you do a capsule wardrobe, fit into that category. It all mix and matches very well. So a simple short sleeve t-shirt is a must if you really want to branch out, or if you already have one of these, try different colors or add a pattern because they do make pattern ones as well and I think that's so cute for example like a striped short sleeve top following that is a tank top of course I didn't plan this but I picked up the same color blue as you can tell I like wearing this this is from Lily Pulitzer it is a ruffled tank top and the back of it is so cute with the little ruffles but it's just a solid blue tank top again you could get a printed tank top I think that would be really cute but I wanted to share the simplicity of this one I will say the ruffle detailing does add to this because there are much simpler tank tops but I think this is so fun and so preppy now I personally still wear long sleeve shirts during the springtime I think it's that awkward season where it's still chilly in the morning and then it gets really warm throughout the day so I pulled out one of my favorite long sleeves this is from J crew it is a striped long sleeve shirt and it's a really fun striped shirt because it's pink and yellow but this is a prime example of adding different prints and colors and patterns to your wardrobe this could just be a solid white or solid blue color t-shirt but it's not and I just think this is so fun to style but having a long sleeve t-shirt is a must for me in the springtime. Similar to what I'm wearing I wanted to share with you guys a button down and these are kind of more of a blouse style top but this goes into that long sleeve category. I love these when you roll up the sleeves and wear it with a skirt, denim, or shorts. I think it's really cute. This is from Brooks Brother. It's just a really classic plaid print. The one I'm currently wearing is from J. Crew. It's pink gingham. I think it's so cute. My favorite thing about gingham tops like I'm wearing right now for spring and summer is they are very lightweight but they also make great layering pieces so I just thought this would be important to include. Along with layering I love adding a cardigan to my spring wardrobe. This is one of my favorites. I've had it forever. It is a bright pink cardigan with white little buttons. It's from Lily Pulitzer. It's a white tag item which is just kind of more of their vintage Lily but I think again you could have a solid. I recently shared an Argyle one in my April favorites I'll insert a card in case you want to check it out so many different ways to style a cardigan but I think they are a great spring must-have for your wardrobe and then I just love having a simple solid color sweater this is from J Crew. it is so soft it's one of those sweaters that's perfect for fall and winter but along with spring and summer because it's lightweight enough that you can wear this into the spring and summer so I love these because you can toss them over 
like this, a cute little over the shoulder look, but they also again make great layering pieces. If I wanted to wear this on top of my button up that I'm currently wearing or just by itself, I just think they're great spring must have. So then I have two types of jackets. I pulled out a crew neck and this is from United Monograms. It says cheers with a little bottle of champagne on it. But I think these are so cute, especially again for those chillier days or if I wanted to wear like athletic shorts, I just think these are great to throw on. And I had to share with you guys a pink one because they're just my favorite. And my last spring essential top is a rain jacket. I feel like we've had a super rainy spring so far. So this is from United Monograms as well. It is a purple one fourth zip rain jacket and it's got my monogram on it and it does have a hood. One of my favorite things about this one specifically is that it's lined so it's super warm and this is great for those early spring days where it's definitely chillier and rainy. Then I pulled out some shorts that I want to share with you guys. I am a sucker for J. Crew chino shorts. I have almost every single color and I'm honestly really proud of that because I think they're so cute. They are so classic looking. I wear I want to say the five or three inch chino shorts and I'm only 5'4 but they are the most flattering length because they're very appropriate but still kind of fun and flirty and I just think they're so classy. So they have like a hidden button clasp which I think is again very flattering on and they have a belt loop in case you want to wear a belt and little pockets. So cute. I love the solids but they do have some prints as well so of course I have to share with you guys my pink gingham pair. Honestly low-key think this dark pink on top with the light pink on bottom could be a really fun crazy busy outfit idea but I love having printed pants because you can put a really simple solid top on top or you can be crazy like me and put two different patterns together so absolutely love Jake Cruchino shorts and then I wanted to share another fun printed short and these are from Lily Pulitzer these are their little scallop buttercup shorts I think they're so cute but I love the scallop detailing on the bottom so cute so many fun different prints that you can get on your shorts that it's such a fun way to spice up any look or just to add some color to your wardrobe along with that I pulled out a skirt and I love skirts I remember these in elementary school where they have the shorts underneath and a skirt on top but I love them because I feel like it just brings a little peace of mind so this is from top it off accessories it's gorgeous pink skirt and it does have a pair of shorts on the bottom I just think it's so cute I wanted to share another skirt and this does not have shorts on the bottom but it's from top shop which is sold at Nordstrom and it's just a denim skirt I feel like denim skirt are really in this spring but I think denim is just so classic that this is a fun way to incorporate a trend into a very classic timeless look. Of course I still like to have a pair of jeans in my spring wardrobe. I just think it's really helpful again it can be really chilly but I love the look of a tank top and jeans or a short sleeve. So these are just some dark wash skinny jeans from Abercrombie and Finch. They are called the Simone High Rise Super Skinny in case you are looking for them. And then my favorite part of spring fashion is the dresses. So of course I had to pull out a Lily Pulitzer dress because I love Lily. This is the Christine dress. It's a short sundress. I think it's so cute. I love this print and I love like the little straps. I just think it's so cute and I love how colorful Lily is. And then I do love a good maxi dress. So this is more gingham. I love gingham as well. And it's just a long dress. This is from Shein. I wear it like crazy. I have it in every color. You guys might see it more this spring and summer season, especially over on my Instagram and TikTok, which are both at Kelly underscore Prepster. I'm trying my best to share alpha videos every single day, but I didn't pull out a solid color sundress. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really have a lot of them. I'm more of a printed dress kind of gal, but I think those are really fun staples to have in your spring wardrobe. I did pull out three pairs of shoes along with a purse to share with you guys. So with a purse, I really think you can honestly do any kind of purse for your spring wardrobe. It's just whatever works for you. I find that I use this Just Fab white leather purse the most. I love that it's got a really nice defined shape. I love the white. It goes with all of my spring pieces and I love that it's got a little handle, but but it also has a shorter strap and I just think it's such a statement bag and it's so cute but also super affordable. Then I did pull out a pair of sandals and it's finally sandal season and I couldn't be more happy. These are my favorite sandals. They are called Jack Rogers and I love the white ones. I was just talking about how if I were to buy my first pair of Jack Rogers I'd either pick out the color platinum or the white color and I will be honest these are my two most worn pairs but 
like these are so cute and so preppy now they are made out of leather and they have this teeny tiny heel it might not be super noticeable but when you put them on you'll feel it the first day that you wear them and they do take a few days to break in but they just make your legs look so good it's just a little lift that you didn't know you need it and they look amazing then of course i had to share with you guys a fun spring heel these are from just fab as well and they are a simple little one inch heel with a little dainty ankle strap and this little strap over the toe i love it i love that there's a little bit of texture that can add to any outfit but it's also a neutral which goes so well and then of course i'm still wearing some sneakers i think these look amazing with jeans or chino shorts and these are my tree torn pink sneakers and i just think they're so precious and so cute of course i had to get them in baby pink so those are all of my spring wardrobe essentials for the preppy gal i would love to hear in the comments down below what you like to wear during the springtime what's your favorite piece let me know i love chit chatting with you guys and i do read and respond back to every single comment i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did definitely hit that subscribe button down below and i will be sure to see you guys very soon with my next new video bye guys <laughs>